hello ict traders welcome back to the channel if you are starting out with ict concept as a complete beginner there are some ict terms and abbreviations that are common to all ict traders you probably have heard some of them before and some of them are completely new to you so i'm gonna give you all of them right here and i will drop a pdf in the telegram community the link to that telegram community is in the description of this particular video and guys if you are new here this channel is completely dedicated to ict traders especially those of you who are starting out with ict concept so what i'm trying to do in this youtube channel is to actually make a sequential arrangement of all the ict concepts starting from the beginner intermediate and advanced level so that you become a profitable trader at the end of watching all the videos right in this youtube channel so these are some of the terms and abbreviations. I'm just going to go through some of them for you. And then I will drop the PDF in the Telegram community so you can go through it. So let me quickly go to the chat and show you some of these abbreviations on a live chat. So coming back to our chat right here, it's pretty much easy to identify this. Previous day high simply means the highest level price reached yesterday. From this, we can see you can identify it from one single candle, that's the daily candle, or you can identify it from lower time frame candles. From one hour, I prefer to go to settings and then come to session breaks. This one, so I can easily have it. Let's say this was yesterday, so this is my previous day high, and this is my previous day low. That is as easy as doing ABCD. So these are the terms you can actually see previous week high, previous week low, break in market structure. I've also made a video explaining all this right here, ABC of market structure. So you don't need to struggle with that. Stop hunt simply means your stop loss is being haunted. You are staying as a liquidity. And we have the shift in market structure when market completely turns direction. Let's assume it is moving upward like this. And then we see it coming down is what we call shift in market structure return to other block is when price comes back to an other block for example let's say this is an other block as price move up from this level to that level as price is coming back to reach for this other block we call it return to other block so some of these terms and abbreviations are actually self-explanatory so you can actually see implied favor look up if the institutional reference points and we can also have institutional order flow entry drill so many of them equal highs equal lows all of these terms i'm going to show you in the subsequent videos i'm going to be making ote optimal trade entry central bank dealer range consequent encroachment is a 50 percent of a fair value gap i've not taught institutional reference point but i will soon show you some of these terms in the subsequent lessons i'm going to be dropping for you right in this youtube channel so guys you can find this particular pdf in the telegram community so simply click on the telegram community and reach out to get these ict terms and abbreviations thank you guys for watching I will make more videos. I will start with institutional reference point. I will treat all the seven institutional reference points that you are supposed to know. And then I'm going to be dropping them in the same YouTube channel. Make sure you subscribe. We are going to continue with our classes with you. Thank you guys for watching. See you in another video.